This is the city of Minden. It's just 100 miles or so west of Des Moines, which was hardest hit. Homes ripped from their foundations. This tornado caused significant damage. And get this, one of three homes sustained damage in that small town. Fox Weather's Brandy Campbell in Minden, Iowa, with an update. We're in Minden, Iowa, after a large wedge tornado spun through this community, devastating most of it. We can take a look at what's left. This is the aftermath of it. You can see large trees snapped like nothing. Homes have been destroyed, windows blasted, roofs ripped apart. One jarring scene. This home right here, you can see it's a white house, devastated, but it's no longer on its foundation. Just to the left, you can see these bricks holes. That's where the house once was. So it's just an example of what residents here had to deal with. And it's not just residents, but businesses uh, in the farming industry that have been impacted. So now we're in the community talking to folks to see what it was like. It was pretty, I don't know, traumatic. We didn't know for sure if it was going to hit. You just never know with tornadoes. So we did take cover at my sister's house because we don't have a basement. Just hoped and prayed everything would be okay. We were, we were one of the lucky ones. But unfortunately, not everyone was so lucky. We met Randy Davis, who lived in the home that was removed from its foundation. Thankfully, he wasn't home. It's kind of crazy. I'm trying to stay in good uh, spirits with it. You know, it's, it's one of those things that you can only do so much. You know, it it wasn't where I left it, so, yeah. you know, so I got a lot of support, though. A lot of my friends are helping out. I'm also relieved that, you know, like right now there's there's a zero zero casualty count, which is a miracle. Now, Iowa officials are saying the town of Minden received the most damage during yesterday's tornado outbreak. Governor Kim Reynolds came by Minden to do a tour and speaking with residents. She said of the 180 homes there, about 40 percent were destroyed. Uh, we talked to a couple of residents that were really impressed with the warning system. They had plenty of advance notice uh, to take shelter, and so we appreciate all that goes into that. Now, this wasn't a first for the small town. I asked the mayor about that, and he thought back to 1976. <laughs> He's, he... That was the last time. <laughs> Let me tell you, you got a guy here that's a mayor that had his home impacted and two or three businesses in the community who's gone through it twice. So uh, not only is he managing the community, but he's dealing with personal loss too. Reporting from Minden, Iowa, I'm Brandi Campbell, Fox Weather.